Ingredients for the chilli. A lot of people use mints when they're making chilli. I think that is such a shame. Just use a nice stewing beef which will br fall apart. Here, this lovely bit of brisket. Lovely bit of brisket, about 500 grams, about 5 euro. Get a little bone marrow thing just for some gelatinous elements. My middle pois, kidney beans, tomato, a little bit of chocolate. A tiny bit of peanut butter and it, I've got my goose stock check out my goose stock recipe bit of, just a little bit of uh, neutral oil in the pan I'm just gonna brown the meat a bit I've cut up the meat into chunks just so that they break up a bit quicker and just to maximize the browning area make sure that you don't overfill your pan they're nicely brown now Let's take them out Yes. Mi mirepoix, mi mirepoix. Scraping the bottom of course and all that and all that. Very important to add salt to encourage the vegetables to release their juices. So if you add ground spices, it's very important to cook them out a bit so that they they don't give a, a grainy, sandy texture. Well, I'm going to put in some cumin seeds whole. About a teaspoon of them. Some cumin powder. A good couple, couple of teaspoons of that. Paprika. Good couple of teaspoons of that. Some cayenne pepper. Maybe a teaspoon of that. I'm now going to build up layers of chilli and heat. Yeah, chili flakes. Always a good idea to use more than one type of chili so you don't just have an even chili note but rather you have layers of chili. And some chili powder. Quite a lot of this. Let's get it spicy. A couple of teaspoons of that. A little bit of cinnamon. A star anise. Very important star anise. It boosts meaty flavours when combined with onions, apparently. Stick a bay leaf in there, why not? Cook those out for about five minutes. Because there's a lot of spice in there and you don't want a sandy texture to the sauce. Let it cook about ten minutes. I'm just going to add a nice tablespoon of tomato puree. Load of garlic. Back in with me meat. The amount of juice that's come off these bastards. Important to uh, obviously, obviously, obviously. In with me bone marrow. Me goose stock. In with me tomato. Right, last few things to add. I'm going to put a whole lime in, just quartered. 50 grams of a very dark chocolate. A teaspoon of peanut butter. Don't want to add too much of this stuff. Just want it to have a little hint of it. And then my kidney beans. I'm going to add a little bit of the juice that comes in here, but not too much because it's quite gloopy. I think that might be starch from the beans. So I'll just stir that carefully to try not to burst those beans. And the last thing I'm going to add. It's just a tiny bit of ketchup, just because a little bit of sugar will help round off the flavours. See how that is in a couple of hours. See you later, guys. Right, the last thing I'm going to do is... I've added a tiny bit of sugar because it was a little bit bitter. And I'm just taking it off the heat and I'm going to add a bit of yoghurt. The yoghurt will just cool it down. I take it off the heat because if I stir in yoghurt into simmering chilli it will split but you can see it's just uh, flaking away now.